Hey guys, it's Jared for NYPost.com, here with the world's most outrageous supermodel, Janice Dickinson, who just invited a fan to become part of her agency. We caught up with her about the new season, her legacy in the industry, and what she really thinks about Tyra Banks. Check it out. Once again, Tyra Banks uh, emulates everything that I do. When I was a judge on America's Next Top Model, she took everything out of the book that I wrote, No Lifeguard and Duty. So after she went through that entire book, I suppose she has to uh, steal from my show, which is uh, her speciality. Of course, a model house. I'm going to close Hollywood and Highland. I'm going to move into the house. Hey. The agency will be right here. What model agent lives with models? Oh, they better watch out. <laughs> The girl that won today really had a great walk. This African-American girl that I saw truly deserves to be a model. And if I can lend just, you know, a slight part in what I'm doing here for uh, a publicity stunt, it's not a publicity stunt for that girl. It could mean a huge future for her. I want you to understand one thing in the Life 32, never tone it down, be more. It doesn't matter if you're blind, deaf, uh, or you're a three-headed baboon, if you're qualified, in this industry, I'm joking. If you're qualified in this industry, that's the most important thing. Stand up straight, okay? Because you're beautiful. She's a role model, and I would like to be a role model as well for deaf people. No, you're good. And so people can also see that, that deaf people are capable of doing anything. I love him. Get out of here. I believe in the models, and I believe in what I'm doing. Don't forget to check out new episodes of the Janice Dickinson Modeling Agency every Tuesday night at 10 p.m. on Oxygen. I'm Jarrett Weissman for NYPost.com. Don't forget to check back every day for more celeb exclusives.